In relation to the incident in Stockton last Thursday night, which resulted in the death of a 47-year-old woman, uh, whilst that investigation is underway and involved officers continue to be interviewed by the critical incident team um, to define exactly what happened, I can indicate that the autopsy on the deceased 47-year-old uh, female was conducted yesterday and we have been allowed by the coroner to release the interim post-mortem results. I can indicate that uh, the death was caused uh, what has been described by uh, the pathologist and the coroner as a gunshot wound to the chest. As you may recall, Assistant Commissioner McKenna did a press conference last week where he indicated that a beanbag round had been deployed uh, to resolve uh, the situation. Those beanbag rounds are defined as a less than lethal option. Unfortunately, in this case, which happens in a small number of cases, uh, it has proven fatal. It would appear that the beanbag round, or the super sock round, as it's uh, known by the manufacturers, has entered the body of the deceased and ended up striking her heart, uh, causing her death. They are interim post-mortem results. Um, as uh, by the nature of the rounds and the, the interdiction that the police took that day, it was uh, not intended to be a fatal outcome. Uh, for the person who was uh, subject of that siege that had been going on for several hours. It was a less than lethal option uh, that was taken uh, and unfortunately on this occasion, as it has done around the world on very few occasions, has resulted in a death.